I was offered for a, a specialist program, and that is a, a highest role for a, a facer in India. Yeah, yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to our new video. In today's video, we have Bijesh Kumar. He has cleared hack within the 2022 round, and in today's video, I am going to share his interview experience. So yeah, let's start. So Bijesh, uh, start with your introduction part. Hey guys, I am Vijay Kumar. In present, I am pursuing BTech in Computer Science and I am in third year. Uh, can you tell me how did you get the interview call of Infosys? Yeah. Uh, Infosys uh, every year for uh, coding competition. I, yeah. I also registered in that and uh, give the test. And I solved uh, almost two questions out of three. Yeah. Uh, I think that was uh, my questions were uh, medium and hard, hard level that I solved. There are yeah. three questions on easy, medium, and hard. So I put uh, from the opportunity for interview. Yeah, nice, amazing. Um, so yeah, Vijay, can you tell me, uh, what are the courses you have followed and what are the paths you have followed for clearing hack with Envy? Yeah, it was a, a long process and uh, I cannot so, uh, say that is a uh, prepared only in a I started uh, ESA in my second yeah. year with my uh, course curriculum and I Cleared my all the confusions or, or whatever it is that uh, in my DSA uh, and I uh, read that time only uh, their theoretical part. Yeah. But uh, still, I didn't understood where to use and how to use these things in uh, problem any in solving any problems. Yeah. When I uh, filled the form of high uh, in after some time, uh, my college uh, gave a link of four patients. The four patient organized a uh, seven day yeah. workshop on uh, competitive coding. In that, they uh, tell us uh, very about various techniques and things to solve and problem. In that I learned how to use our DSA to solve our problems, and I learned a real use of DSA. Yeah, and amazing. Many and many programming approaches uh, such as VD, Helsing, AP, Backtracking, etc. Yeah. So, yeah, can you tell me uh, what are the topics you have got in your Hack with Envy examination? Yeah. That means, uh, in which topic your question are in? My questions were, uh, okay. the questions I solved, they were uh, both from uh, Hashing. And uh, I cleared my Hashing concept uh, in that training that was organized by Coach Hussein. So yeah. it was a uh, bitter uh, luck for me that. So. Um, what is the topic for the third question? Uh, for question was uh, some easy level question, but uh, the question was written in so briefly, and uh, yeah, I think that uh, two other questions I understood very easily. So I started from uh, there, and I didn't put extra time for uh, solving the easy question. Yeah, after uh, the examination, in how many days you got a uh, uh, interview call? Uh, was uh, something about uh, on or one month or after the result you uh, got interview call after one month isn't it so can you tell me something about your interview like yeah, how so it goes uh, first of all they started with uh, an introduction I yeah. then see uh, I was a lady. Then she asked me to 
share my screen. Yeah. And it was organized on Microsoft Teams. After sharing the screen, uh, she asked me to send my resume to her uh, by email. Yeah. Then I on that I suggest your viewers to uh, try to send an uh, email from a laptop. But yeah. sometimes it is uh, sometimes a different to sending emails in desktop uh, other than a mobile. Yeah, they will follow. After that, uh, she started uh, coding questions. She uh, gave me a easy level coding question and uh, stated me that if you are able to solve this question, then we will. Continue. Yeah. Otherwise, and I solve that. And what is the topic for that question? That was an uh, easy level question. That was related to some math. mathematics. Yeah. Okay. After that, I solved that question. Uh, see, uh, I solved uh, it uh, using three uh, methods. Yeah, amazing. After that, uh, after that, uh, she gave me another question that was middle level. Uh, that question was related to hashing. Yeah. I solved that question very easily. And I told her that uh, I solved this question using hashing. Then appreciated me. And in the next question, that was a hard level question. It was something related to array, but uh, unfortunately, I was not able to solve that question completely. I solved that question partially. Partially, yeah. And apart from so coding, that, after that, uh, she started with Jeff, and she asked me first of all explain my Jeff part it was and how it works. I explained that how it works, and she asked me some comments of uh, my project and about some technology I used. Apart from that, she also asked that we have to uh, do some improvements in that project. Then what can we do? In many aspects. Uh, Bijis, uh, can you tell me uh, in which domain you have created project? Yeah, uh, my project was. Uh, Related to in like a, it was an PDF uh, reader. Yeah, I made it uh, in Python, and it was uh, API based. All right. After project, then after project, he asked me some questions from data structures and algorithm. After that, uh, he gave me. Uh, real life problem in computer and ask me that how it is implemented or how you can implement it yeah and i tried it and initially uh, my solution was something like unavailable approach and at last i told her uh, appropriate data structure that i use in serving that problem, then see that yeah, it's right. Yeah, amazing. Uh, then what happens in your interview? At the time, it was uh, almost one hour completed. Then she asked me to ask you any question from. Then yeah, asked you, I asked her some. And she uh, explained about, it. and then the review uh, was. I thanked her. That's all. All right, amazing. So this is the total your interview experience with Infosys. Uh, can you suggest our viewers how they can prepare for hack with fees and all, and other competitive environment examinations like code with. Code with an NPTQs. So, 
uh, these Kotlin computations are uh, based on problems. Uh, that problems uh, having almost all uh, Kotlin computations having easy level to hard level. So we should prepare for all of them. For this, we have to clear our concepts such as data structures and algorithms. Uh, which, uh, and also we have to uh, learn as much as uh, problem solving techniques such as yeah. uh, dynamic programming, testing, backtracking, etc. Uh, so can you tell some of the sources from there they can prepare? So, I use uh, Geeks for Geeks much time yeah. for my preparation. Uh, there are here, the articles are so amazing, understand. Uh, and also, the, first, uh, the students who are uh, preparing for this, they can also solve fast uh, questions or yeah. they can practice their uh, data structures, topics on Geeks for Geeks. That would be a uh, very useful. Tool. Also, they should uh, practice solving problems on daily basis so that uh, they have uh, an on hand experience on how to use and where to use which data and algorithms. Yeah, it's cool and amazing. So, so that's all for this video. And thanks for coming, Bijesh, to our channel to share Thank your you. interview experience of Enforces. So, yeah, thank you.